President Trump will hold a rally in about an hour in Lake Charles. We have team coverage inside and outside the Civic Center. Some people waiting in line for hours to make sure they get a seat. My co-anchor Kevin Still is live with a preview of what the president will focus on tonight. Kevin. Good evening. We're live at the Lake Charles Civic Center. Would you just look at this room? Two thirds full already. The president will be speaking for at least an hour and these folks are wound up. Louisiana U.S. Senator John Kennedy speaking just minutes ago saying the president won the White House for one reason. He did not talk down to the American people and never will. You see the signs behind me. Jobs, jobs, jobs. The president expected tonight to talk about the unemployment rate. He's so proud about 3.7% unemployment rate in August. A big ovation tonight for two women holding a flag reading Trump 2020. No more BS. Didn't stand for bologna sandwiches in that case. No more BS. Everybody went crazy. It's an excited crowd and the president doesn't speak until 7 p.m. tonight. Outside earlier we talked to one man who said he supports President Trump and always will for one reason what he called the president's courage. People in Washington don't have no guts, but I think our president does, and I hope our new uh, governor of Louisiana does also. That is the latest from inside here, a festive crowd. But outside, earlier, my colleague William Blanchett went to work talking with folks in these long lines waiting to get into this building. Will continues our team coverage. Hey, William Blanchett here. I'm outside the Civic Center, Lake Charles, where hundreds of people have been showing up since about seven o'clock this morning. Now, President Donald Trump doesn't talk until seven o'clock tonight, but people have just been coming out here uh, showing their support. Now, we spoke to a lot of his supporters, and it's fair to say that people are not happy with the Democratic and Republican Party. Uh, I got a chance to talk to a group of women who support the president who made their own church, which say, Jesus is my savior, Trump is my president, and directly on the back of their shirts it says he is the chosen one. I think he's done a lot of good things for our country and if the people in the House and the Senate would leave him alone, he could get a lot more done. I think God chose him to get this country right, get us back on our feet, and get us back with the Lord like we need to be. Now again, the president is not speaking until seven o'clock tonight. I'll continue to be outside the Civic Center here in Lake Charles, talking to folks, talking to supporters to hear what they like to hear from the president tonight. We'll send it back to you. Okay, thank you, William and Kevin. Again, we're about an hour or so away from the scheduled start of this rally. We'll have it live on our website app and on our 12 News Now Facebook page.